Now all the parameters we have adjusted is for this size bottle. For example, now we are going to change for this kind of bottle. How should we do? So firstly, we should add uh, the stop to adjust uh, this the bar so that it can move all the way around. Now it was stuck right here. Let's rotate. This is a bottle sensor, move a little back. As long as it can sense the bottle, it will be okay. Light is on. Then here, we can see now the height is not enough. We need to rotate it up. Then we let it uh, open the emergency stop button and it go to menu page. Let's see, this okay. For the holder, now we're going to adjust this holder because this holder is a four little bottle. Now we're going to move it a little back so that the the bottle will be bigger. There was two screws here. You will take it here. So this can move forward and backward for a big bottle. And let's move it here. And with the other side. This side also can move forward and backward and for this bottle. Then to choose a good position, then fix the false screw now. And also here should it be fixed so it can hold the bottle tightly. Okay, now let's try. Uh, go to main page and open stuff. Sorry, the, it's because now there was uh, no water inside, it's a little light, it will fall down. For example, this is water, so it will be heavy, not fall down. Now this happened because uh, the, the after the bot the sensor sends the bottle it clamped too 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 early. So we go to the parameters, then change the uh, delay cover, bottle holder cover, delay holding bottle. This one zero point three. After zero point three, it's going to hold. It's too early, so we change it to 0 0.5 and try. Now, this time is good. This time
because there was some screw inside and it's always moving the cutting handles. Now since we uh, still have problem for the time, but let me see what's the problem here. Oh, it's move. Let's touch this. And a little higher. Okay, thanks for watching.